guys. Hey y'all. Hey everybody. I'm back with another makeup tutorial today, but today is going to be a little bit different. So we're going to be doing a challenge that I came up with and it is called the Favorite Color Eyeshadow Look Challenge. And so what you do is you type in um, like your favorite color eyeshadow look. So mine is aqua, so I typed in aqua eyeshadow look. So uh, whatever color you choose, purple, blue, yellow, you know, whatever. And then you pick the first picture that comes up. So you don't get to choose what color, what, which look you want to do. You just pick the very first one that you see. So yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a very simple challenge, but um, kind of it can be challenging if you get a really hard look. Um, as your first look, but you just gotta follow through with it. So let's get into the video. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on all my foundation and my concealer, and I will be right back. All right, I'm back, and I've got my foundation and my concealer and my powder on, and I'm gonna say blush and highlighter for last today. Okay, so for today's I look we're going to be doing a brown with an aqua kind of color I'll put the picture right here um okay so we always start off with the transition color so I'm going to be taking let me see what's in this palette I'm probably gonna be using something out of life's a beach from W7 and no those are all shimmers but I will be using the aqua out of here um okay so so I've got my Be Bella Silent Night palette that it won't open. <laughs> and I'm going to take, oh lord, there's so many browns. Okay, we're going to take the middle one on the bottom row right here. And we're going to tap into that and put some of that in the crease. This eye look is pretty simple, but uh, for those of y'all who don't know how to uh, do transition shades and shades in the crease, then it might be a little bit challenging for y'all, uh, but you're welcome to follow along with this tutorial. Um, it's just a basic eye makeup tutorial. falling off the, um, not the table, the counter. There we go. Okay, now we're going to take, here it is, a blending brush and we're going to blend this out. This eye looks different. This one. I'm gonna put a little bit more. Okay, blend that out some more. Okay, now they're even. And we're going to take the all over shadow brush and if I can find my spray, there we go. We're going to spray it and put on some of the light tan color at the very top of the Silent Night Be Bella palette. Okay. This one, the lid. quiet in here and my stomach has not been feeling very well today. But that's okay. I'm gonna push on and do this tutorial. What am I looking for? Oh my blending brush, which I do. Here it is. Okay. I'm gonna blend this out into the brown on the top. I'm gonna blend that in on the bottom. Okay. 
And see the crease color isn't as dark as I would like it, so we're just gonna go back in with a little bit darker of a color. We're going to do the second to last on the bottom row of the Bella palette. Okay, tap into the lighter color again to give it that um like chocolatey brown shade. Okay, take that blending brush again and blend it out. Take Life's a Beach, the aqua color in it, the, hold on, let me see, right there, and we're going to take uh, this color right here and use that. Okay, so first we're going to take the darker color, I can open it again, accidentally close it, not bad. Okay, we're going to take that aqua color from the BH palette that I just showed y'all and we're going to take the detailer brush. Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to do the detailer brush or the Oliver Shadow brush. I feel like if I use the Oliver Shadow brush it's going to go like too far into the lid more than I want it to so I'm going to try the detailer brush. So I want to spray this and tap into the uh, the aqua color in the BH palette. Okay, tap into that again and do the other side. Okay, wipe that off, and now we're going to spray it again and use the Life's a Beach Color Sea Foam. Okay, spray again and tap into Sea Foam. Now we're going to take oh, it's like wet all the sun's brush. That's not good. Okay, now we're going to take the very first color on the BH palette and we're going to use the detailer brush again and we're going to take that light color and put it on the very end. Okay, take that light again. are done. Well, let me check and make sure they didn't do eyeliner. Even if they did, I probably won't do it though. Okay, and it does not look like she did highlighter, but she does look like she has glitter on her eyes, so you know what that means. I've got to find the glitter glue, and is this it? No, that's not it. And put some glitter on here. Um, technical difficulties. Hold on one second. Okay, so we're going to take this base booster from BH Cosmetics and I want to take a little bit, tiniest drop on my finger, see? And I'm going to put that on the uh, inner portion of my lid. Take the same finger a little bit on your finger and put on the other eye. Okay, put that dry. Okay, 
like once it's tacky, you want to take um, a. Let's start with a detailer brush because I don't want it to go everywhere. So we're going to. Hold on, let me close this. I'm going to shake it around. Okay. So we're going to take the glitter on the inside and put it in the inner lid. Get all that glitter off my brush. Okay, so now we have the glitter down, and it kind of matches, like, it's a little bit of a brown tint, so it matches the outside. So, you know, pat me on the back. That was a good job picking that one out out of the three that I had, so, you know, it's not a huge deal, but. Okay, moving on. Sorry, I had an itch on my nose. We're going to take, where's my blush brush? There it is. So we're moving on to blush and highlighter. So we're going to take the Milani blush like I usually use and we're going to tap into that. Tap off the excess and circle it around on the cheeks. Okay, now we're going to take the Maybelline Master Chrome and we're going to put that with the fan brush on the high, the high bone of the cheek. You know what I'm talking about. Somebody messaged me. Oh, they did. I'm a lonely girl. Better I don't like a like bam glowing highlight. I like a very soft and subtle highlight. My stomach. I'm so sorry. mascara and lipstick and we'll be finished. and I like missed and it went all over my hands so sucks for me. Okay, now I need to do lipstick and we'll be finished. The look doesn't have a lipstick like on the on the picture. But I'm going to do, sorry, my nose is itching really bad. Um, I am going to do, what does this one look like? Mm, too dark. Okay, I need like a nude-ish color. Here, here we go. My Katy Perry cover girl. It's really dirty, sorry. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna open that up and put it on. Okay guys, that's it for today. I hope you like the look. Here we go. Do like a little turn around so you can see it all. So guys, subscribe to my channel, ring the notification bell, comment down below, and share it with all of your friends. Hope you all have a blessed day. Goodbye!